First, your boy Ascalon became a five-star recruit as an undersized high school quarterback. Then, he led his high school team, the McEachern Indians, to a state championship. Next, he took his talents to Georgia Tech, where he started as a true freshman, broke five school records, and won an ACC championship. Now, he has a chance of winning a national championship and finishing the season with the perfect 14-0 record as the Yellow Jackets face off against the Alabama Crimson Tide. What's going on everybody? It's your boy Ascalon and welcome back to NCAA Football 14 complete with college football revamped. This is episode 23 of my Road to Glory playthrough series. It's here, the national championship game. So in my sophomore season, I led the Yellow Jackets to a national championship game and we're going against Alabama. But before you get to see what happens, I gotta shout out the commenters from last episode. You know how I do it in this playthrough series. Let's get to those comments. Comments number one and two come from Craze Lil Broomstick or Crazy Lil Broomstick, a usual for the NCAA Football 14 series. Glad you're still loving it. And then the second comment here, I think you should stay at Georgia Tech. I've made up my mind and you'll find out at the end of this episode what's gonna happen. Will Ascalon remain at Georgia Tech or will he transfer to another school? You guys got to stick around to the end of the episode to find out. All right, comment number three comes from my buddy Zach over at Coca Culture, pointing out all the amazing things that Ascalon did in the ACC championship game. And I like the mentioning of him being snubbed for, you know, the major awards. And I think it does have to do with bias against the ACC. But also, I think, you know, my junior season, I might have a better shot at getting those awards. Seems like when you're younger on this game, your freshman, sophomore season, unless you just play like amazingly, they don't really want to give you any major awards. So hopefully my junior season, I might be in the running for some of those offensive player awards as well as the Heisman. So we'll just have to stick around and see. And yeah, the kicking game, I don't know what's going on with our kicker lately. Three extra points missed in the last two games two important games <laughs> so i'm hoping he can get it together uh, we can't be yeah we can't be missing out on any points against bama that's for sure but thank you zach for another comment i appreciate it comment number four comes from southern boys truck gang glad you like the video i'm glad you like my vibes i just try to i try to keep it chill over here on the Ascalon channel, you know, but playing these sports games, sometimes I do get a little, <laughs> I get a little intense, I get a little upset, and I love the, hey, Georgia Tech. Um, I think this person, if I remember correctly from the comment, is a Georgia fan, which that makes sense. I'm an Auburn fan myself, but I grew up, you know, for a while when I was a kid, up until I was about a teenager, I was like everything Georgia Tech. And it was mostly because I liked the basketball team that they had in the 90s with like Kenny Anderson, Mark Price, all of those guys. Might have been even part late 80s. I can't remember exactly. I was really young when I fell in love with Georgia Tech basketball. And then I also loved the baseball team. Baseball was my first sport. And so I really liked the Georgia Tech baseball team with like Nomar Garcia Parra and all of them. And so I became a Georgia Tech fan. Like we would go to Six Flags little side story we go to six flags when i was a kid and i would always uh or my dad would do the you know the basketball shooting game you know a little carnival game that they have and if we you know won they used to have basketballs with different college teams on them so i would always get me a georgia tech basketball so as a kid i kind of had my heart set on going to georgia tech when i went to college that didn't happen and so you know choosing georgia tech in this road to glory playthrough series like that that kind of factored into it. The fact that I had wanted to go there as a kid, but I didn't when I grew older. I ended up moving to Alabama and going to college there. So uh, 
yeah that's why i picked georgia tech <laughs> but i do understand you know people not necessarily liking georgia tech so thank you for stopping by thank you for dropping a comment i greatly appreciate it and comments five and six come from my buddy ill blurred matic yeah i just you know i love shouting out the commenters i feel like you know that has really helped this playthrough series to get you know some comments and i i just love hearing from people like comments is one of the biggest things like i can receive on my channel not only you know like any validation that you're doing a good job but just to connect like i feel like that helps me to connect with the community that i'm trying to grow here and so when you guys leave me a comment i'm like yes they're engaging with the video i really enjoy that and i get to respond and we get to have a good time you know talking about whatever game i'm playing or just talking about video games in general so yeah, I'm going to continue to do that, you know, future playthrough series that I do on my channel. I'm going to try to keep that going because I really felt like that has really helped me to connect with U.S. Guardians out there, my wonderful community. So thank you for your comment. I really appreciate it. All right, this is it. It says right there, I guarantee a victory against the number two Crimson Tide, the national championship game. Let's get into it. I'm going to put us in not the Cape Day uniforms for this one. We're going with the black watch for this one. All right, I wonder if they're gonna put Bama in the white or if they're gonna wear crimson. Oh, I'm nervous. Here we go, okay, they are in crimson. All right, we're gonna get on the ball first. Come on, defense. I <laughs> Maybe maybe I should have kept the ball first, but, cause I don't like playing from behind, but I want the ball back at the halftime. All right, let's do this. And of course, whoa, whoa, what is going, what happened? <laughs> it is 14 to seven already. I guess we scored on a kick return or something. I don't know. All right, my first offensive series, we're down 14 to seven in the first quarter. All right, let's do this. Okay, we are not running that. <laughs> Almost ran an option. That's how nervous I am. I'm not paying attention to the play. All right, let's get it going, Gibbs. Oh, man, they're too good. One yard rush. Oh, this is going to be a tough game, y'all. I don't want to play like, you know, some of those teams. They go into a game against Alabama and they know how elite they are. They know how good they are. And they just kind of, you know, cower and roll over and die. <laughs> you know, I don't want to be like that. I want to actually compete against them and show them that we're the number one team in the nation and we deserve to be here. Good job, Norris. Never gonna roll over and die for anything. I'm a competitor. All right, I like I like this play right here, so I'm gonna try to pass again. Oh gosh, I got stuck with Devaney, but he managed to get some separation. Let's go, Devaney. Man, that boy got some good feet for a tight end. And of course, we already know that he can catch the ball. Nice. All right, let's see if we can get the run game going. Come on, offensive line. I need you guys right here, right now. Let's go. We gotta get these points back. Go Gibbs. Oh, got around that guy. Good. Nice run, Gibbs. There you go. There you go, line. That's how you play. Good job, fellas. Gotcha, McCollum. Good catch. Nice. I was about to run, but I saw some things happening. They got confused their defense a little bit there. And then McCollum got open. And we got a first down and a 26-yard pickup. Go Gibbs, go Gibbs, go Gibbs. Oh, crap. Oh, he trucked that guy, and that guy still managed to hang on and make the tackle. Uh, that was a good play, Malachi Moore. That's why, you know, we kind of always tell our, our middle schoolers, you know, on defense, grab whatever you can, hold them up as long as you can or whatever for other people to get there or, you know, just so you can hopefully make the play. And that's what that guy did right there. McCollum, touchdown, get in there. Was that not face mask? I guess it doesn't matter. We're on like the half a yard line right there. Man, I thought he got in there. We need this. Tied up. I need defense to stop them, though. I don't want this to be a back and forth game. Defense is going to have to stop them at some point if we're going to have a chance of winning this game. Go, Gibbs. Get in there. Touchdown. We're about to tie it up. If I, my kicker can make the freaking extra point, you know how he do it sometimes. Come on, please don't miss this extra point. Yes, he got it. Defense did not hold them. Come on, defense. We got all of these All-Americans on defense. And we can't stop Alabama at all on any drive so far. Like, it's ridiculous. Come on. 
All right, we're still playing from behind. Maybe I should have just should have got the ball first. Good run, though, Gibbs. Ooh, I may try a bubble screen right here. I don't know. This could be bad, but I want to see if we can we can make it work because they probably watch film on us, and I want to try some stuff that we don't typically run. They go king. Hey, we got the first. He got clobbered, but we got the first. Three-yard pickup. I'm perfect so far through the air. Got you, Sanders. Nice. Got you right on that break, King. Nice catch. Young King stepping up. I mean, I don't know what grade he's in. I'm assuming he's like a freshman or a sophomore, though. King stepping up, making a couple of good catches in this game, this national championship game. All right, come on, Gibbs. Get us the first. Let's go. Oh, we do have the first. Never mind. <laughs> All right, just keep running the ball. Oh, that guy came right through. I had a feeling they were going to stop our running game pretty effectively. They're going to want me to win the game through the air. And I'm gone. Good block. Good block. Good block. Get out of bounds. Nice. 20 yard pickup from your boy. That was a good block right there on the edge. I don't know who that was. It was one of my receivers. I think it was McCollum. Yeah, good block. I'm just glad he didn't block him in the back. That would have been bad. All right, he didn't. He didn't crash. And Gibbs almost picked up the first. Good read. Getting better at those read options. I've been more effective with those lately. That's why I'm not hesitant to run them. Go Gibbs. Go Gibbs. I just want the victory. All right, I may try to toss one right here. All right, Gibbs had his chance. It's my turn now. Oh, good defense right there. That guy drifted with, uh, I think it was Sanders coming across on that slant there. Oh, it's second and goal. I thought it was third and goal. Man, I'm getting my downs mixed up. Go Gibbs, go Gibbs, go Gibbs. Crap, no. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, I turned the quarter. Get in there. Touchdown. Oh, man, I thought that guy was going to sack me. He was fast, but I was quicker. All right, defense, come on, bros. I need y'all. Oh, gosh, I thought he was going to get me right there. I need y'all to stop them, please. Come on. <laughs> I dove in there for good measure. All right, come on, D. They scored again. Alabama has scored on every drive they've had in this game. <laughs> this is turning into a shootout at this point. Like, this is ridiculous. Our defense can't stop them at all. So that means we got to score every time if we can, which is going to be probably more and more challenging for me to do. But I'm going to play my best, and I'm going to do what I can to make sure that we win this game. I've only thrown nine passes so far in this game. But Alabama's been chewing up a lot of clock because they've been scoring every freaking time. Gotcha, King. Nice, King. That's three catches. He didn't have that much experience during the regular season. I mean, he had a good amount, but, man, he's stepping up big in this championship game. I think that's, that's good for me because if they watch film, they probably know I like to go to McCollum and Sanders and Norris a lot. And so they may be double teaming them, and that leaves King open. Ah, uh, Not a bad run, though. Four yards, not a bad run. Gosh, I threw that too late. Dang it. Good play by that guy. Man, if he had missed that, though, Sanders might have been gone. Come on, Sanders. Good catch, Sanders. Oh, I was nervous when I... Why don't you call a timeout, coach? Man, I hate when he does that. I'm trying to run the clock down some, so if we do score, they don't have a whole lot of time. All right, we'll run it then. Um, but, yeah, I got a little nervous what I was trying to say on that. But Sanders... Made the catch, and I put it in a good spot, too. Go, Gibbs. Go, Gibbs. Go, Gibbs. Go, Gibbs. Stiff arm that guy. Five-yard pickup. Our coach called another freaking timeout. You bum. Stop calling timeouts. Gosh, man. Oh, that guy drifted with Sanders. Get rid of it. Dang it. It's like a linebacker or something. He stayed underneath, and I had nothing. Sanders was almost open. 
All right, we got to stop running slants. We got to run something else. Up, oh, that's slants too. Oh, <laughs> uh, well. Crap, I ain't got a whole lot of options right now. Good catch, Nor. Oh, he had it. Come on, Norris. We can't have that. I know that was a lot of traffic, but that hit his hands. And of course, we're not going to go for it. This is the national championship game, coach. Come on. They scored a freaking again. The crap, defense. They have 401 yards that he put up on us. Gosh, man. One deep. Ah, oh, that was bad. Come on, line. Give me time. Give me time. Give me time. Got Norris right in that seam right there. Good job. All right, hurts a line. Hurts a line. Hurts a line. We got the first. Hurry, 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 hurry. Hurry, get set up. Get set up. Get set up. Get set up. Go Norris, go Norris. Did we get the purse? Did we get the purse? Yeah, we did. Yeah, we did. Hurry, 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 hurry. Get there. Oh, Sanders. I know I threaded the needle a little bit there, but oh man, that's the second time. I don't know if that hit his hands, but that's the second close catch we almost had there. All right, what the crap? Why did Coach pick that? I don't know. I don't want to do that either. Hurry, 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 hurry. Throw them off, throw them off, throw them off. Got your Gibbs. Got the first hurt to the line, hurt to the line. We don't need to call the last time out yet. Hurt to the line. Hurry, 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 hurry. Got your Leonard, you better catch it too. Got the first, hurt to the line, hurt to the line. I'm not using that last time out yet. Hurry, 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 hurry. Hurry. Got your Norris. Did he get in there? Is he short? Hurts a lot. Hurts a lot. Hurry, 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 hurry. Come on, Gibbs. Get us a push, O-line. Come on. Get us a push. Get up, get in there. Get in there. Hurry up. Stop the ball. Get in there. Get in there. Touchdown. Yes. All right, we're gonna be down by four unless we go for two. Why? What? This is a championship game, coach. Come on. All right, we got the ball back and we're down by four. All right, let's slow it up a little bit. Oh my goodness. Flash of the Titans right here for real. This has been. This game has been crazy. Go Gibbs. Nice run, Gibbs. There you go. Lower that shoulder. There you go. Good job, Gibbs. All right, man, I need defense to stop them if we score here. I hope we can score here. I got a feeling if we don't score here, they're going to start to put the game out of reach. All right, we're going to run it again. Come on, Gibbs, get this one yard. Oh, good job, good job, good job. Yes. Oh, this is so stressful. Feels like real life. <laughs> Go Norris, what a snag it. Second and inches, that's fine. Gibbs can get the extra yard that we need. I don't have any touchdown passes, but I feel like through the air, I've been moving the ball pretty well and putting us in position to score, especially that last drive right at the end of the second quarter. So as far as I'm concerned, I'm playing pretty good so far. Man, of course, I would like to throw a touchdown pass in the national championship game, but if we get the victory and that doesn't happen, then that, that's fine. Oh, man, Gibbs, you should have turned it on up, dude. We only needed a freaking inch. Come on. Will Anderson Jr. made that tackle. Really wish my coach will stop picking four verticals. We need to run no daggone four verticals. Stupid idiot. Gotcha, Norris, quick. If I got a nickel and dime, that's fine. Good job, Norris. Norris got seven catches, 86 yards. Gotcha, Harris. That's Harris' first catch. Harris has been kind of silent this game. King has kind of took his spot. Sanders has been kind of quiet, too. I think he only has one catch. He does have a drop, though. Oh, well, in that case, then, since you know we're running it, let's change it. Oh, why did I throw that? All right, now let's run it. 
I don't think they'll expect it right here. Come on, O-line. Oh, no Gibbs. Oh, man, that's not much of a hole. Oh, he got three yards. He got more than I thought he was going to get. All right, come on. We need this first right here. We're four. Four for five, converting third downs in this game. So that's pretty good. Good, King. Oh, my gosh. King has been so clutch in this game. Four catches, 41 yards. You got a bright future ahead of you, son. Love it. Harris and Sanders have been silent, but King has stepped up for us. All right, I'm going to take a shot for the end zone here. All right, well, not on that play. <laughs> Maybe the next one. Crap, I got me another rusher touchdown. Let's go. Haven't thrown any, but I got two rushing ones. I got hit hard, though. All right, we're going to be up by three, I guess, if we get this extra point, because I'm assuming there's no point in going for two right now. Wow, I look like I was short. <laughs> Hope they don't challenge it. They scored so freaking fast. What the crap? This is ridiculous. Like, oh, crap, one of those. Let's let the play clock run out. You mean to tell me our defense can't stop them one time? They have scored every single drive. And we've pretty much done the same thing. But I've been forced to. Gosh, man, my defense sucks so badly. Gotcha, Norris. Block for him. Oh, I thought he was going to cut back to the left. Good. Well, one yard short. So let's give it to Gibbs. Eight catches, Norris. 100 yards. Norris showed up to work today. Actually, I might run this smash play right here because I kind of like it. Come on, get over, get over his head, the king. Ah, I underthrew it. And I didn't wait long enough for him to break out of that route. All right, come on, Gibbs. I'm trusting you. Oh, Gibbs is not in. All right, what play are we running? Okay, I think I can get the first here. There you go, king again. He's getting some short catches, but he's catching them. Even in traffic. Good job, king. Get us that first. Ooh, that guy got pancaked. First down run from Jameer Gibbs. 17 carries, 17 or <laughs> 77 yards. And I can't remember how many touchdowns he has. Ooh, McCollum. Oh, gosh. I threw it. I led him the wrong way. Did he catch that? Oh, gosh. I meant to lead him to the left. Oh, man. That would have been a big play. There was nobody there. And I led him right to the defender. I got, I got happy. <laughs> Little trigger happy right there. You got McCollum underneath. All right, 35. I sh should not have probably made that decision right there. But, man, I mean, with this Alabama defensive front, you got to be quick on getting rid of that ball. All right, I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. Don't give me. Don't give me. Don't give me. Don't give me. Yeah. Get out of bounds. Nice. I got two over 20 carries in this game. Four carries, 54 yards, two touchdowns. No passing ones, though. But I did get to see the end zone in the national championship game twice. Come on, Gibbs. Go, go, go. Cut it up. Cut it up. There you go. He cut it up a little too late. Probably could have got a couple more yards, but he got six. So, oh, man. Oh, he batted that down. Oh, man, I should have just kept running. Oh, I did not think he was going to do that. Oh, some good plays by some of their defenders. Man. Oh, come on. I got that off quicker than that. Come on, coach. We got to go for it. We got to go for it. Come on. Thank you. Finally. Oh, why we didn't go for it earlier. There's two other opportunities where we should have gone for it. Get there, get there. Oh, good block, good block. Oh, oh, I fumbled, but I was out of bounds. Oh, gosh. That could have been bad. I was trying to hopefully, like, sneak in there. Gotcha, Norris. Oh, he dropped it. Come on. 
Should have been a touchdown. All right, Gibbs. Actually, Smith's in. All right, Smith, get you a touchdown run. I think I said touchdown run. Get you a touchdown run. Oh, man, that was my chance. What is he doing? <laughs> uh, uh, I don't know which way I want to go. He better be glad he got in there. I would have, like, never let him run the ball again for the rest of the season. <laughs> I know this is the last game, but still. All right, defense. I'm going to have to start watching y'all pretty soon because I'm tired of this back and forth. They scored again. What the absolute crap, man. This is ridiculous. It's 49 to 45 in a national championship game. This is ridiculous. Come on, Gibbs. Come on, Gibbs. Nope. Shoot. Alabama's a four-quarter team. I hope we're not starting to get tired. Oh, gosh. No, I don't want to run that stupid play. Crap. Ocean pass and crap. Block for me. Nice. Get the first. Oh, I got hit hard, but I got the first. Oh, man. This game so stressful. Go, Harris. Saw him wide open right there. Second and inches. That's fine. Gibbs can hopefully get it. I think I still got hit in the backfield right there. Yep. That guy was like, I'm not letting you get on that edge <laughs> this time. He's like, you got to go through me if you want to take off running this drive or this play. Whatever I'm trying to say. Come on, Gibbs. Get in there. Yes. Nice. What? It's a jet sweep play. That's See, I don't even know which plays are these at this point. Like, some of them got the same names as our other plays. Uh, I'm just gonna, we got enough time left, so I'm just going to take the delay of game penalty here. I don't want to use any timeouts yet in case I need them on the last drive of the game. Oh, I'm so sick of these stupid plays. Man, defense just sucked this game. Like, if we lose, defense just sucked this game away. Get there. Oh, King. I uh, placed it there. He just couldn't bring it in. Crap, man. Needed that. Now, that, now my receivers are gonna start dropping passes and crap. Oh, oh, he still got me, you bum. Thought I had escaped him. Crap, third and thirteen. Oh, uh, la 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 la. Oh, good catch, Harris. Oh, I thought that guy batted that down. Oh, he stuck an arm up, and it looked like it went through his hand. I don't know, but good catch, Harris. Oh, that might have saved us right there. If we if we win the game, that was the game-winning play right there. Oh, my goodness. I don't want to do a draw. Let's just run counter. Oh, my goodness. Okay, I need to hurry up and score because if they score again, I want to make sure I got enough time. All right, second and five. All right, let's try to get in the end zone now. Go McCollum. Nice. John McCollum. Oh, I didn't mean to dive. <laughs> I got six yards on that. I did not mean to dive. <laughs> Meant to slide. Oh, I floated that. He almost picked that. That was almost really, really bad. I was throwing off balance, and it caused me to float it. Crap. That was almost awful. Oh, man. That was almost bad. Lock for me. Never mind. I got out of bounds, you bum. Oh, he's wide open. Yeah, it's Keys. I don't know who you are, Ryan Keys. My fullback, he was open. I got my first pass and touchdown, and we are up by three. Defense is now or never. I I got to watch it. I got to watch it. I need them to hold them. Oh, man. I mean, I may be watching something terrible. We're playing in Arizona. That's so cool they got the Arizona Cardinals Stadium in this game. That's really cool. But anyways, I got to watch it. I got to watch it. What's the button? Move, score, and drive. Watch play. 
Please don't miss this extra point while I'm watching. That has happened before to me already. Oh gosh, it almost did. We're up by three. Oh, watch and play. Because I think they've been running stupid kick returns, punt returns back. Oh, I don't know if we punt it. But kick returns. Mechie. Come on, get him. What? He's still going? Are you kidding me? Why can't we tackle this dude? Oh, come on. Uh, ah. All right, we're watching. Oh, man, if they get a stop. Oh, I'm doing everything I can to run the rest of that clock out. Come on, get Bryce Young. Get Bryce Young. Wide open. That's a tight end, isn't it? Cameron Latou, whatever his name is. Come on, guys. Or is he a receiver? I can't remember. Get Bryce Young. 26 for 37 passes, 420 yards, five touchdown passes. I think he had 420 yards. Come on, 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 come on. Come on, get him. Oh, oh my gosh. No wonder they've been scoring every drive. Look how porous our freaking defense is. Just holes everywhere. That's his first rushing attempt. Wow, he's been murdering us through the air. Look at the total yards. We've combined for over a thousand yards total in this game. Come on. All right, look, they're about to score. All right, well then I guess if you're gonna let them score, it, it needs to be quick then defense because we need time. Right now, only got two minutes left. This this is gonna come down to the freaking wire. This is ridiculous. Let them score next next play. I'm about to start calling timeout soon. Come on, dang, Mechie's got 12 receptions, 181 yards. Double team him. That seems like the only person he's been going to. All right, they're in touchdown. They score quickly. All right, this is gonna be it for us. All right, we're down by four. All right, do I have another two minute drill in me? We're about to find out. Yeah, they got all the people back down the receivers, but you gotta watch me too, cause I will take off if I have a chance. If I gotta win this game on my feet, then that's what's gonna happen. Got you, Devaney. Go, 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 go. Get it first. Oh, nice, Devaney. Nice, nice, nice. What? Oh, my goodness. I, I, I'm I, sorry, Devaney. I called you soft earlier in the season. Oh, my goodness. How did he get through there? I didn't even think he was going to get the first down right there. That was beautiful, Devaney. That was beautiful. Oh, too many people over there. All right, just get out. One yard rush. All right. You know what? I'm about to do something they don't expect. We got all three timeouts. Field goal won't win it, though. Job Gibbs. All right, let's call our first timeout. Oh, we got the first, though. I shouldn't have done that. All right. Coach, let me clock manage. You you, you just, they got all three timeouts. Okay, I don't want to score too quickly. But get them enough time. Are right, we going to run with Gibbs right here? Second and six. I know that's weird. But I'm also trying to get the clock down as low as I can get it if we do manage to score. Good Gibbs. Good Gibbs. Good Gibbs. Nice. No, why did coach call time out? Why did you do that, you idiot? Man, do not call another timeout. Oh, Gibbs about to get in there. Okay, he didn't. Okay. All right, I was hoping he didn't get all the way in there right there. Okay, we're going to let it tick down. Some before we snap this ball. I don't want to tick down too far, though. I got to make sure we got enough time as well. Oh, man. Got you, Devaney. Touchdown. 20 seconds left. Oh, we got to stop Mechie. Oh, my goodness. They got, they got enough time. 23 seconds. Oh, gosh. Uh, I was hoping it would be under 20 seconds. I was thinking about just running it. But I was like, ooh, I have a chance to get a second touchdown pass. I got a little... A little greedy there with wanting some touchdown passes. Hope that doesn't come back to bite me in the butt. All right, we're watching everything from here on out, just like we did last try. Although they moved the ball down the field so quickly. Got the extra point. That was a little low, though. All right, come on, y'all. Stop Mechie, please. Stop Mechie. Put it somewhere he can't return it. Did that boot into the end zone? Oh, Sanders is bringing it. Come on, come on, come on. 
All right, 19 seconds left. Oh, man. Oh, my heart, y'all. Look, if, if we lose this game, you cannot say that the offense did not play well. Like, that is totally not my fault. Oh, gosh, giving him time. He went underneath. Good, good. I'm okay with that short crap. They got all their timeouts, though. I'm okay. You can throw short stuff all you want to, Bryce Young. That's fine, especially ones where you don't get the first down. Come on, 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 come on. Oh, gosh, he went deep there. Oh, he dropped it. Oh, hallelujah. 35. Oh, gosh, eight seconds left. Y'all, come on, game. Give it to me. Come on, give me this national championship. Give it to me. Come on. Oh, gosh, I'm almost too afraid to look. No. Yes, we batted it down. Fourth and five, two seconds left. This is the last play. Oh, gosh. Just, even if they catch it, just don't let them score. Just don't let them score. Come on. Come on, defense. Come on. Come on, get him, get him, get him. Put pressure on him. He threw it short. Get him, get him, he's on the sideline, get him! Yes! We have the national championship! <laughs> oh, defense, why, why, why did y'all do that to me right there at the very end? We won it! <laughs> oh, man, that was probably my best offensive performance of my career, like, oh, man. Oh, why did they show that that's the play of the game? That uh, that one play, what was it? Either Devonese or I think it was King early on. One of those should have been play of the game because those both saved us. Oh man, we had to score every offensive drive. That was the only drive for them on offense that they did not score. I got player of the game. Oh look at that trophy. I mean they scored every time on our defense except for that last drive. And really, they just didn't have enough time. If they had more time, they probably would have scored. Oh, we did it. We did it. Perfect season. 14 and 0. The Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets. Oh, man. Like, I don't know how my junior season can get much better than this. The only way that could happen is, you know, a repeat <laughs> for a national championship and go undefeated again. Wow, keys right there. Thank you. Thank you for being open right there, buddy. I was like, I don't know who he is. He's open. Hopefully he'll catch it, and he did. Oh, what a game. Like, during the game, it's, it's stressful. You know, the back and forth scoring, but after the fact now, I'm like, that was an amazing game. All right, we're going to go. That was the number one ranked on the ESPN Instant Classic, I bet. All right, we're going to go and wrap up my sophomore season. So we can start getting ready for my junior season. Oh, what a game. Yes, add that trophy to my profile, please. Look at that. Classic brawl. Georgia Tech outlast Crimson Tide. <laughs> Should be Alabama there. In high scoring national championship game. All right, before we advance the week, let's look at the final stats for the season. So I was 327 for 461 uh, in passing with 4,645 yards, 36 touchdowns, and nine interceptions. I stayed under 10 interceptions, so I did not get the double digits. Average 331.7 yards per game, 70% completion rate. Longest pass was 85. And my sacks this year, I got sacked 38 times as opposed to I think I got sacked over 50 times last season. So standing in the pocket more was definitely an improvement with the sacks there. Our Gibbs had 259 carries, 1,721 yards. I had 160 carries for 647. Smith had 47 carries for 299 yards. Gibbs had 21 touchdowns. I had 13 and Smith had seven. So we were the primary rushing people. Receiving, Norris had the most receptions with 64. Finished with 949 yards, five touchdowns. Harris is the only receiver to get over 1,000 yards with 60 receptions and seven touchdowns. McCollum had 56 receptions, 778 yards, three touchdowns. Sanders, 55 receptions, 796 yards, eight touchdowns. Devaney, 46 catches, 639 yards for seven touchdowns. And then King, 24 catches, 287 yards with three touchdowns. I mean, he had a lot of big catches in that championship game. Gibbs got some catches out of the backfield as well. 
Let it Smith. And then Leonard's got a few this season. Leonard did get a touchdown. And then Keys, championship game. <laughs> One catch, three yards, but he got a touchdown out of it. Well, that was awesome. On defense, Demetrius Knight the second led, led the way with 73 tackles. Look, <laughs> they barely got any assisted tackles. That is not right. There should have been a lot more assisted tackles than that. Freaking crazy. But anyways, Knight had the most tackles, 73. He had 11 tackles for loss. He had the most. No, he did not have the most sacks. Jaquan Griffin had the most sacks with eight. Derek Allen had four interceptions. <laughs> I'm on the defensive stats because I had two tackles. <laughs> I think they, were, they both came out there through picks. Pass deflection, Sims had the most with eight. Demetrius Knight the second caused the most, the most, the moist. He caused the moist fumbles. <laughs> Demetrius Knight the second caused the most fumble and got the most fumble recoveries, it looks like. We had no safeties. We have any defensive touchdowns? Nope. Right, let's look at our kicker. Nine for 11 on field goals. He didn't get a whole lot. He's a freshman, so I cut him a little slack. Look at those extra points, though. 72 extra points made, 77 attempted, 93%. So he missed five kick returns. Smith had 19 kick returns, 636 yards, three touchdowns. Then Norris had 18 kick returns, uh, 399 yards, no touchdowns. And then punts was all Smith, 26 punt returns, 206 yards, no touchdowns. All right, I want to look at uh, my legend score really quickly. See all my achievements so far in two years of college named national player of the week three times defeated a rival team four times conference championship we won that won a national championship give me that ring first team NCAA all-american once first team conference all-american make the national championship game make a new year's six bowl game make a bowl game we did that twice First team freshman All-American, be named player of the game 19 times. Player of the game in the rivalry game four times. Player of the game in the bowl game two times. So both bowl games of my career, I was player of the game. Player of the game in a New Year's Six game. National champion player of the game. No three touchdown passes in the game. I did that 14 times. I threw over 300 yards 15 times. Rushed for two touchdowns in the game. I did that six times. Whoops. Throw for 30 touchdowns in a season. I did that both seasons. Throw for 3,000 yards in a season. Did that twice as well. Got 60 touchdowns in my career. Got the school record for six passing touchdowns in the game. School record for passing yards in the game. School record for passing touchdowns in a career. School record for passing yards in a season. It says I did it twice, I guess, because I broke my own record. 36 passing touchdowns in the season. Again, I broke my own record. There's still a lot of stuff that's still available that I didn't get. Oh, a lot of these are other positions. NCAA record is 5,833 passing yards in a season. Man, I'm like over 100 shy of that. That's crazy. I'll have to play like... Wait, no. I'm a 1,000 yards short. <laughs> I'm stupid. Uh, I would have to play like three or four more games, maybe, to get that. <laughs> it's crazy. If we played an NFL season, I could get it. But, of course, that record would probably be higher. All right, let's see the final polls. All right, so Alabama, since they lost to us, they moved down to number three. USC moved up to number two. <laughs> they have three losses, too. What the crap, man? That's, nah, that's lame. So that's the coach's poll. Then the AP, Alabama dropped down to number five. Iowa State's number two, then USC, then Oklahoma. All right, so of course, John Mechie the third got NCAA Player of the Week. And they didn't even win the game. But surely I got ACC Offensive Player of the Week. Yep, I did. Wow. Okay. Let's see how y'all do. That's fine. All right, so this concludes another episode of NCAA Football 14, complete with college football revamp. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button. 
My junior season is coming up, so more NCAA Football 14 Road to Glory for you guys in the near future. Uh, drop me a comment below. Let me know what you thought about this game against Alabama, this shootout that we had. Uh, it was crazy. Drop me a comment below, and your comment could be featured in the next episode. If you're new around here, check out all of my content in addition to Let's Plays like NCAA Football 14 on my channel. Also do gaming shorts on my channel and gaming trailer reaction videos as well as unboxing videos for video games monthly it's monthly subscription service that i have with them so if you like the content definitely consider hitting that subscribe button i'm on social media facebook instagram twitter and tiktok all at Ascalon. same name as my channel so follow me there for additional content my wife and i have a youtube channel together called team rixie where we post vacation videos and taste test videos and our instagram for that channel is team underscore Rixie where we post vacation pictures. All right. This was a fun time this episode. It was stressful, but it was fun. Oh man, we got a national championship. Brought it to Georgia Tech for the first time in a very, very, very long time. Hope you guys enjoyed it. So before I completely go from this episode, make sure you guys stick around in just a moment for another episode of Morning Cup of Sports where your boy Ray Jeezy, the radio host, is going to be giving you some news about Ascalon's future. So stay tuned for that. I will see you guys in another video. Y'all take care. Peace. If you want sports before work, then you're in the right place. Welcome, 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 welcome to the Morning Cup of Sports Radio Show. Welcome back to the Morning Cup of Sports radio show. I'm your host, Ray Jeezy, and I'm here to bring you all the juicy stories happening in the sports world today. Our first story involves your boy Ascalon. Apparently, after winning the national championship game, he has decided to transfer schools for his junior season. I knew it. I knew this would happen. The Georgia Tech Athletic Department did him dirty after he gave them and his team his blood, sweat, and tears this season. I mean, the things he accomplished this season, despite being at odds with the athletic department, is nothing to scoff at. I can't imagine being 19 years old and having to deal with not only the pressure for playing football, but also the pressure from the people who ultimately controls your playing time. So, which school is Ascalon transferring to? To all my faithful listeners out there, you won't believe this. In fact, you will probably think I'm lying, but I am not. I have multiple sources confirming that Ascalon will be transferring to this school in particular, and he's taking a teammate with him. 